Ito po, Hotel Stars EU and Deutsche Hotel Classificium. So classified po siya until 2025 as a four-star hotel. Ayan, ayan, after 9 million years, plato na po kami. <laughs> My next up po yung plato. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> Award winning na <naman> kami. <laughs>
Sidi ko ba? Sa labas, may dalawang bed dito. This is a family room. Dalawang bed dito. May dalawang bed pa dito. Tapos mayroon pa sa likod. So ngayon, hindi ko po siya ipapakita kasi may mga gamit nila for privacy. But ito yung sa mga bed nila. May queen bed. King bed siya. Malaki. Sa labas nila may um, sunbathing na bed. Tapos may dalawang chair which is good for having coffee. And tingnan niyo po yung kanilang view. It's very nice. It's very bucolic. And um, it's very country. Pero, may pero ha, it's full of greens. Full of greens. Meaning, maganda po siya sa mata. It enhances our mood. It enhances our mindset. Tingnan niyo po. Ayan po yung aking mga kabayo. Kung gusto niyo pong magsakay, sabihin niyo lang po ako, 5 euro, 5 euro, 5 euro. Charot. So, dyan po. Ito po yung event center. Sa baba, dito. Sa inyo mga kahoy. Forest, ano siya? Covered with forest siya. Forest and other agricultural areas. Pero ito siya ranch. Ah, may pony din pala sila. Oh, na, iba't ibang kulay ay. Ayun, so, um, so hindi po nakakaalam, um, ang pag re po ng kabayo and doing racing or other, um, leisure activities involving horses, it's a luxury sport po. I remember one time na sa Toronto kami, may event kami sa sa isang ano sa isang uh, event um, exhibition area malawak na malawak talaga siya masyado and grabe talaga grabe the, this, this sport the game the leisure the hobby of racing horses and uh, arranging them why yung dalawang ay number 3 ay number 2 number 2 malong i i i i change i sent to you papi okay ayan ayan lumabas po tayo for more serene at uh, focus po tayo sa pag-share sa inyo ng mga interesting facts so yun nga siya Um, wow! O, oh, talaga may ranch dito, o. Oh. Inagawa, pinapractice yung equestrian. Yung mga sport ni, ano, yung Olympic, Olympic, um, Olympia natin, si Mikey Kuwangko, equestrian, na involves horses. It's a luxury sport din po. Ayan siya. So, dun po sa nangyaring exhibition na na-attendan na ko po, actually, nag-serve po ako, hindi ako nag-attend. Nag-serve po ako as, um, a server. Nagbibenta ng mga ano yun? Karahe ba yan? Yung mga ano ng kabayo, kalesa, ganun-ganun. Diyos ko, ang mamahal. Diyos ko, kaloka. Gabi talaga, you have to have real money para ma-involve ka sa ganitong klase ng hobby. Kaya yun, mga kawangko, syempre, they have real money. Sino lang naman tayo? Hindi <laughs> kawangko. Pero yun nga, shot, as they shared out that it also comes with the roots. Kasi nga, you have to have the love. For you to appreciate po yung pag enjoy nyo sa ganitong klaseng hobby. Dapat may love kayo for animals. Ready kayo for sa mga manure, sa amoy ng, ng kabayo, sa hirap ng pag-train ng kabayo, sa pagsakay ng kabayo. Siyempre yung physical hazard niya, kailangan din po yan. So, it's really a very interesting, um, interesting uh, hobby that not everyone can actually relate or not everyone can actually involve themselves with themselves with kasi nga marami siyang financial requirement may dapat may rancho ka pa or magrent ka ng rancho para you can do the practice so ganun so kung may ektarya kayong mga ano diyan nang gawin natin <laughs> ayan ayan nagprepare prepare na po tayo para sa ating uh, presentation later on so we will go and talk to you later muna Samahan ko muna sila, mag-bonding muna kami dito sa Four Star Hotel, The Park Hotel, Surinburg. Hello, hello! Ayan! This is our first look for today. Kahit na may mga allergies tayo, 
But we are here now at the lobby and we are preparing ourselves for the opening of Le Catlatic. This is a Filipino conference where there's a lot of Filipino foods, a lot of Filipino related performances, cultural performances, and modeling. Ganun po. So, tubo na tayo today. Hindi mo na ako nalagay ng ano, kulang-kulang pa ang ating look for today, but mag-retest lang tayo mamaya. <laughs> gonna check out na po sila. We're all here. We're all gonna be set very soon. Ayan, ayan. Ito po yung first look natin for today. <laughs> So, andito na po tayo, and I think most of our invited guests are slowly arriving. Magsisimula po yung program by 2 p.m., which is about 20 minutes from now. And then, kami nag-rest muna kami, nag-cafe, doon sa bar. Ang ganda ng ano, kasi, yan, may restaurant sila dito, which is open for, the, ano na, for only for um, peak hours, which is uh, eating time. Siguro for dinner as well. Tapos may coffee shop sa loob. Tapos din, doon din yung breakfast para sa mga gustong magbe-breakfast. Dito po yung ating uh, ano, dressing room. Sorry po. <laughs> Go ma'am. Sorry ma'am. Isipin niyo from the conference room. Harap po nito yung training area for the horses. So I think it's a very important um, amenity that this uh, hotel can offer. Kaya po may extra star sila. Kasi di ba? Tinan yung muna ha. You know, like training siya. Ayan. Ayan, di ba? So. So, um, nag-add up po ng potential um, stars or classification kapag kayo have a very special and unique amenity na ilan lamang po sa mundo ang meron. Kaya yan, usually mga three-star hotels around the world po is um, they would have special amenities like golf courses within the hotel or within the resort area, um, special amusement parks, um, apart from their services and their facilities, ganon. So, um, I think that's one of the important things that they have here. Isa sa mga competitive advantage ng Park Hotel Surinborg. So, time na po natin para magbihis at ipakita ang ating galing. Samahan niyo po kami. Para sa ating unang performance, ang Igorot Dance. Ito po yung ating forma. Kasama natin si na Mami Rose. Team Blended. Team Blended. Si Ryan, si Papi, tsaka si Dong po yung ating mga lalaki. Kasi di ba, um, um, courtship dance po yung gagawin natin sa Igorot. So may partner-partner. So it's a very short dance lang po. Just to showcase po of, uh, just to showcase uh, what we have. Uh, in terms of um, cultural identities kasi very important na ma-expose din natin po sa buong mundo especially here sa Germany kasi marami ng mga Pilipino na dito na lumaki and they were not exposed to the kind of cultures that we have in the Philippines so this is a very good opportunity for us to showcase this particular culture <laughs> At sa aming pag-checka-checka dito, nito na pala si ate. Ay, hello, hello! Can I kain pa mag-picture na tayo? Let's go. Siya siya, paano nga nang name mo? Mary, Mary, Mary Seaver. Pra of, anong ano mo? Anong creations mo? Yung anong may ano ka, um, trade name ng ano mo? May store ka or just you? As a person? Ano lang, sa bahay. Sa bahay? As design. Uh, nasa, ang atelier ko, nasa bahay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, Isa po siyang banggiitan talaga. Isang sikat na designer po. Isa yung banggiitan. Oo, isa talaga siya dito sa ano din, sa Germany. Isa siya sa mag-showcase ng kanyang mga collections. Um, Bisaya din siya taga Davao. Pareho kami kaya. Go, bis, go, bis, duck, go. Charot. <laughs> Patreon mo na tayo kasama ang ating performers group. <laughs>
Ayan, ayan, after 9 million years, plato na po kami. <laughs> May next na po yung plato. Oh my God! <laughs> Award winning na po kami. <laughs> oh my God! Grabe ka loka. Pero ang saya. Si Mami Gracie. Oh my God. Hi. Hi. Greetings from Germany to Canada. Thank you. <laughs> kind of Toronto, right? Yeah. Toronto. Hello, Toronto. <laughs> it should not be Toronto. It's Toronto. Hi guys! <laughs> 
<laughs> How are you doing? Hello, dreamers! At long last, tapos na po tayo sa ating performances. Oh my God, pagpasensyahan niya na. At konti lang atin nakuha ang mga copies ng videos na ating performances and preparation. I-check niyo po sa lahat ng members ng Team Belmany. Kasi I'm sure you would see a lot uh, from different perspectives, from different views and opinions, and violent reactions. Shut up! I meet my friend, Ingo! <laughs> so right now, oh my god, grabe talaga. It's it's a very very nice ano. Kala ko sila. It's a very very nice um, experience po that we are able to showcase Filipino dance um, cultural dances. We are not uh, professional performers po ng Filipino cultural dances but then we're able to at least provide to them the, the entertainment and educate them and show to them through our costume how important culture is in the Philippines and how vast the culture is in the Philippines, di ba? I'm sure that um, for those who are here for the first time and to witness our dances and our, our, our outfits, na enjoy nila ng masyado ang aming ano, may mga princesa pa kami, meron, di ba? Hindi, hindi naman lahat nakakapanood niyan, hindi nila alam yan, so at least through our own small way, kahit three times sa kami na practice, three times pa two times. Two times lang. One, let you sell sa, sa, sa amin. Two times lang pala, imagine. But we were able to make it. May mga, may mga minor ano, mistakes, pero it happens. It, can, it can't be perfect. We're not perfect performers. Yeah. We're not professional performers after all. But at least we were able to showcase na nakapagbigay kami ng saya kahit pa paano. And with that, we are very happy and grateful already. So we would like Sa ako na lang, sa akin lang pala. <laughs> sa, para sa akin lang, I would like to thank the um, organizers of the of Likhat Latik, uh, the Dal Glam Productions, for inviting us and for letting us uh, showcase in our own small little way the talents that we have and the happiness that we can share to others. Ayan, ayan. So for the meantime, ito po mga live audience ko. Pa! <laughs> My live audience pala. 
Check ka na, check kasi ba din ba na po? Ayan. Ito ba yung third look natin for tonight with all with with allergies inside and outside. <laughs> with pa feathers pa si Mayor. Thank you sa aking uh, um, outfit sponsors. Of course, my dear sisterettes. Where is where is she? Yung sisterakas ko po and oh my god. It's time to enjoy. It's time to Relax. indulge ourselves with some libations. Charo. <laughs> Maglalasing lang pala. <laughs> Time na pa enjoy kasi um, yung pinaghirapan po namin for a few weeks, we're, we're already done with it. So, Time to enjoy the moment with Tim Balmany. Enjoy the camaraderie. Enjoy the harmony. Enjoy the family. Enjoy the love. Enjoy the enthusiasm. And most of all, enjoy our Filipino culture. Maraming salamat po. Charot! <laughs> At dyan po nagtatapos ang Likhat Latik 2023. Thank you so much, Tim Balmany! Ayan, ayan, so grabe, sobra, sobra, action-packed, jam-packed event po siya, oh my god. May kanya-kanya po kaming perspective sa aming mga video, so wag niyo pong kalimutan panoorin lahat ng videos ng Team Belmany. At makikita niyo po ang ganda ng Likhat Latik 2023. Maraming salamat po! Thank you.